Hello, I'm Damian Mitchell. The technical leader of Jamaica's team in Rio, Maurice Wilson, says 400 meters hurdler Geneve Russell this morning passed a fitness test and will participate in the Olympic Games. There was a major controversy when it was revealed that Russell was left off the IAAF's entry list for the 400-meter hurdles. Meanwhile, sprint legend Veronica Campbell-Brown and shot put standout Odeen Richards were last night named captains for Jamaica's track and field team at the Rio Games. The decision was made after a lengthy team meeting inside the Olympic Village. The father and son who died in a car crash along the Greenvale Main Road in Manchester have been identified as 46-year-old Craig Lewis and 23-year-old Kevoy Lewis. The third deceased, a relative of the two, has been identified as 27-year-old Jerome Israel. A doctor at the Chapleton Hospital in Clarendon says scores of people have been expressing an interest in adopting the one-day-old baby girl who was abandoned in a shoebox at the facility last Saturday night. The child who was found on the compound sometime after 10 o'clock is said to be healthy. The police are reiterating calls for Jamaicans to be cooperative when being arrested. JCF Communications Officer Stephanie Lindsay says redress is available to persons who believe that their arrest was unlawful. In your weather forecast, Tuesday morning will be sunny. During the afternoon, expect isolated showers and thunderstorms across inland areas of central and western parishes. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. I'm Damian Mitchell.